Words like astonishing and sensational were used to describe Ye Xiaowen's world record as she won the 400 metres individual medley on Saturday. But it's the description given by John Leonard, the US Executive Director of the World Swimming Coaches Association, that has caused this current storm. He called the performance unbelievable and impossible, pointing to the fact that over the last 50 metres, Ye had swum faster than Ryan Lochte, the men's champion in the same event. Accusations of drug use have dogged the Chinese for many years. This current crop of swimmers still living in the shadow of the doping violations committed by their predecessors. But the man in charge of China's anti-doping program says any suspicions are based more on prejudice than facts. In a statement he said, I think it isn't proper to single Chinese swimmers out once they produce good results. Some people are just biased. We never questioned Michael Phelps when he bagged eight gold medals in Beijing. It is inevitably a sad um, result of the fact that there are people who, who, who dope and who cheat. Um, but I equally think it's, it's very sad if, if, if we can't um, applaud a great performance. On Tuesday, thousands of fans headed to the Aquatic Centre for the evening swimming finals, one of which would include Ye Shouen. Many feeling the teenager should be given the benefit of the doubt. You can't criticise someone that quick, but you may have to like, analyse the footage. I'm sure they've actually done that. So probably by judging by the time, did she actually swim faster than Ryan Loxy then? In the last 50 metres she did. Yeah, so probably that's why she was suspected of doping. It's difficult, right? But Because it was such a huge margin, like five seconds, I think it was, something like that. So... She bested her time by five seconds, but I mean, there's a rigorous process in place, right? So with the IOC coming out firmly in support of Ye when the matter would seem to be closed. But with the 16-year-old due to compete at the Aquatic Centre tonight in the final of the women's 200-metre individual medley, another record-breaking swim, and those whispers of doping could get ever louder. Rahul Pathak, Al Jazeera at the Olympic Park in London.